kind of come here, would you say that it's kind of like, I mean, to say that what you're about ready to do is a very intense experience is an understatement of biblical proportions. Is it kind of that moment to catch your breath, get your mind in the game, relax a little bit so you're not all stressed out, and then get ready to go accomplish the mission? Would you say that's a good reason why this place is here and why it's, it stands to this day? Yeah, no, I, I think, think so. so. I mean, it, it's, it's a buffer. I mean, you, yeah. uh, you're not going to learn any more in the last seven days. <laughs> Can't be cramming in. Yeah, <laughs> There's no cliff notes, right? Uh, no. It's well, a little, it's a little downtime, and like you say, it's it, yeah, a bit somber at times because you know what you're doing is. is a little it, there is a risk involved, right? And uh, you have to share that with your family and your spouse. And it's just a real nice place to do. But, well, again, and I think the fact that it was isolated, and uh, you know, you you end up dealing a certain amount with uh, the press and the media. And, and uh, of course, during that quarantine period, you're pretty well isolated from that anyway. But this was one place where you knew you could just, the phones weren't gonna ring, you could, you could just get away and just have that kind of quiet downtime. That was very, very important part of, I think, getting your right frame of reference to, to get ready for launch. Yeah. And it, it is, it's a special place, you know, so you feel, I mean, it, you feel like, I mean, you feel like you're part of something here. You feel like it's all part of the, um, you know, the build-up to walking out to the pad. And and it's certainly, I mean, I appreciate that, you know, like you said, kind of the isolated aspect of it is that you can walk down the beach with your spouse and, you know, talk about whatever you haven't talked about yet. Or, you know, just, you know, be happy about the fact that, you know, you're getting to go do this and, you know, what it really means. It's well, Nicole, you mentioned it a bit earlier about, the, uh, you said basically the multiple goodbyes. When you have things, things happen during these missions, you're like, okay, goodbye, honey, I'll see you in a couple weeks, and it's like, scrub, next night. Tell us a little bit about that and how this place kind of perhaps plays into that somewhat. Yeah, I think, you know, I think some of the others of us have experienced that as well, but <laughs> yeah. um, it is. I, you know, my experience was for both missions was, you know, at least one time where we were here for the week, and, you know, for five days, you're coming back and you're saying your final, goodbye. you know, you know, see after the, the mission kind of thing. And you, you, we got to the point where we'd kind of joke around, all right, see you, bye, see you here tomorrow night, you know, whatever. <laughs> and, um, but you know, I mean, there there was, you know, there's heartfelt feelings there too. I mean, it's, you know, it's the same for your spouse. They're kind of like, okay, you know, there's that side of it that says, man, do I really have to do that again? Why don't we just, you know, let's get this thing off the pad. And then there's a, oh, a bonus, you know, you get another night to yeah. hang out before you launch. Yeah, we, we had, uh, if you, like you were saying, you have the rest of your crew here. We were a two-ship operation, so we're like, we're here with our ship, and you get really, really, really close to those folks because louder. <laughs> Please. <laughs> yeah. Um, and you get to have dinner here and, you know, share a little wine, and, and there was this tradition in the past. I don't know if it's still oh, there. It's still there. I know we did it. I know what you're talking about. Did you yeah. do that the yeah. first flight? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, I think I know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> wine bottle. Signing, yeah. Sign, putting Sign in the wine bottle. And my, my mom had... Uh, found a, a, a winery in New York that was called Space Shuttle Wine, and they gave us some Space Shuttle Wine, and so there are bottles down yeah. somewhere in there that say Space Shuttle Wine. You know, did did you sign it? And, and the whole crew signed it. Right? So oh, okay. Spouses, so Cruz and spouses signed that signed the bottle. And they're, they're all over the place. Right? They used to yeah, be on the They field. used to be all over the place, like up along on a, a bookshelves and all around, and when they clean the place up, they, there's now a very nice display, display downstairs. With they're not all displayed, I guess. Wine I, bottles, yeah. When I was out here for a conference, I looked, and I, I think one of the missions was there, but the other one was not. Yeah, I'll have to check it out.